What up, fam? Welcome back to the vlog. I'm Jazz, and Deb is over there somewhere, and kids are over there munching on this delicious vegetable soup that I'm getting ready to show you guys. This is the end, and I'm now making the beginning. This was a quick instant pot meal that I'm getting ready to show you guys. I pretty much got whatever we had in the refrigerator, and I um put it together and made some vegetable soup. You like, you like the vegetable soup? Whoa. You spit off? This is a disaster. Let's just get into the video, baby. But as y'all can see, it's not a lot of meat. It's just about two and a piece neck bones in here. So I'm about to make like a, I guess this would be a one pot meal for like one person. Yep. Or for or for the kids, yes, or for the kids. So it's vegetable soup. So we don't need that much meat. Put that one pot to work. But I'm just gonna season. You can season yours how you want, but we got 16. some garlic powder. Sixteen. Onion powder. They just hit y'all, fam. Now you see. Fuck y'all in the head. I don't. Oh, they can't see. I do a bowl. I do a bowl. They can. And there's just some oils because we're gonna sear these neck bones so the flavor can get sealed in. Well, before I did you guys. Yes, but I'm gonna be so happy when we get this room. Because I ain't got no shirt. That's why y'all keep on looking at the instant pot. And I don't have and the food. Problem. We cooking for y'all, but we behind y'all. You know what I'm saying? It's some real true day in the life type stuff. But just some garlic. Okay, now it's burning a little bit. Okay, you can have all Just a few minutes on each side to get them. To lock that flavor in. So what we're doing right here. We're locking the flavor in. So necessary and vital step. Sear your meat. It'll be a treat. And, and you'll thank us when you eat. This is my first time doing this. So y'all see it. This is one hand. I mean on hand. I, I make vegetable soup all the time. But I haven't did it with this least amount of meat. And... I think I'm missing some ingredients. Oh, I usually have cream corn, but we don't have it, so we're gonna make it do what it do. Cooking goose, we come back, zoom in, so I ain't gotta be close. Get some last stuff. Get stuck steam. to the bottom. Mm -hmm. That's a cup of water. We gonna start with that. We just picked y'all up, fam. Look at the veggies. We love our veggies round. Yeah, yeah. Here we go. This is the key. This is the key, key, key. Mm -hmm. I do enjoy Instant Pots because Instant Pots have made cooking a lot, lot easier when you're ready to eat right now. Now we got that good old diced tomatoes going in might not look like much now nah. but let me tell you in about 30 minutes we gonna come back and we gonna let y'all know how it look Fred. cooking with bay and bay <laughs> oh. and Lab but not Lee. Got this uh Chicken boy, y'all. Yeah, boy. 
and some beef. We like the marination Ooh. flavors. Ooh. More. Now, when it comes to seasons, man, don't be afraid to freestyle because you know your flavor palette better than we do. This is just a base if you want to make it like we do. Yep. But if you don't, that's cool. You got to have the same uh, base, at least, I guess. However, your seasoning game is up to you. Our seasoning cabinet is deep. It's actually about time for a restock. You see, we running low. Like, it's about time to replace that one. Oops, failure. Replace, 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 replace. Yeah, as y'all can see, it's about time for us to stock back up. Grocery time coming. Now, on this part, although we added water, you can add vegetable broth, chicken broth, chicken broth beef broth, especially because it's yeah. vegetable soup. But people are very particular these days, so if you add like any of people, like it's not vegetable soup if you add chicken broth, so people are particular. Be That's all we gotta say. I'm about to say be careful, but is your food going in your mouth? Now we're about to walk away for about 30 minutes and we'll show y'all what it look like when we come back. Pop on and we finna be gone. This is what meat we did end up with. And since it's kind of for the kids. Be boning it. Be yeah. boning it. The for the bones disintegrate. I did cook it for about 50 minutes. And we got some This is all the chicken we had left over from a nacho video. So I'm gonna throw that in there since it's vegetable soup. It's just shredded chicken. I just got some noodles out of the pantry and I'm going to throw those in there. Those are going to be cool. Yes. Something different. Something new. Well, it may not be as formal as it usually is, but hey, we behind the scenes, day in the life, so it's a little bit more raw and uncut. We are glad that y'all are here today. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 3. We just around the house enjoying the cold enjoying our children's company although they're sick however they're getting better so that feels good baby adonis was acting like he was catching something this morning but he seemed to be back to him normal self so that's always a blessing aiden and andrew are in the room they just kicking it i don't know i can't stand still in the same spot comment down below if you are like that and like the cooking videos it would appeal you appeal to you more if like it's multi shots instead of just one area and talking in the same shot for a prolonged period of time let us know what y'all think down below i did add another bag of vegetables because i felt like it wasn't enough. i was gonna ask but i ain't want to say nothing on camera if it yeah, like i was putting you on front street i mean no i was you gonna cook. say babe, you some cook more, too. Babe, i want to eat some more vegetables Oh, I need to show the talk to your mama. Okay. Okay. I'll be quiet. But I'll talk to you. I'm not going to put the meat back in there yet. Let the noodles cook first. Big. Uh, we use crusties sometimes because you ain't got you know, I got time to go from zero to a hundred mm -hmm. and from scratch scratch so we're gonna show y'all 
We finna show y'all the cornbread hack. Or if you have ever had Jim and Nick's cheddar biscuits, very close. One third. That's one egg bang. One. Two. Balance out the cheese. You put some sugar in it. Just a little bit. About a fourth of a cup. How the cornbread muffins came out. Golden deliciousness. Woo. It's good, babe. Good? Yay. Good, Ada Good. Good, Juju? No? Sorry. <laughs> it's good, Adonis. Watch some more. Yeah, you do. You were supposed to say, yeah, she wasn't supposed to know you had some, for real. Shh, you gotta keep that a secret, okay? Mm. This is the first time with these, with these noodles. <laughs> big this ass is. noodles. Big old, big old, big old ass noodles. <laughs> they got extra swell, y'all. I would suggest using macaroni or something. Ooh. I'm gonna say what news probably go good with these. What? The um man, we got them in the, got them in the pantry. Um, the Kappa Toppy? Yep. Mm-hmm. I looked at them, but I said, oh well, if I get this, the soup can go all in the holes and stuff. Bad idea. Yes, ma'am. Yep, bad idea. What I mean as far as the Kappa Toppy would have. It would have had more. It would have went noodles. in the spoon. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, it, at least I mean, it tastes good. Soup good. It's good. It's soup good, though. I mean, with these throw up stands on my jacket. You couldn't really see it. No, son. You can't have no more. My baby is cutting up, so we have to leave, you guys. I tasted the soup, too. And I uh, burnt my mouth, so. Yeah. That's enough on that. But as you can hear, baby Adonis is crying. Everybody is munching. That is all for this vlog. We hope you guys enjoy. Make sure you give it a big thumbs up. No, you can tell them to subscribe though. Subscribe. Until next time. Love you guys. Until next time. Love you guys. Yes, you can go wash your hands.